enough to make a difference in people's lives that we work to improve it. Thank you very much. Law enforcement, school officials, and community members met in Wellsboro tonight to talk about a troubling trend in the northern tier, heroin. And facts from local leaders are making parents even more nervous about the problem. Good evening, everyone. I'm J.B. Buno. Thanks for joining us here on the Late Edition in High Definition. In Tioga County, Pennsylvania, law enforcement officials are fighting an increasing amount of heroin in the area, and it's not just the adults who are using Kids are also abusing heroin at a much higher rate than seen before in the northern tier. Now, tonight, Wellsboro High School leaders hosted a forum to discuss the problem and how to stop it. WNY TV's Joe Melillo was there. He joins us live in the studio with our top story tonight. Joe. JB, tonight's discussion was focused on education. That's the first step to stopping the rampant drug use being seen in Tioga County. Part of dealing with a problem is saying it out loud and acknowledging that it exists. And that's what part of tonight is about. Tioga County Judge Robert Dalton ended Tuesday night's forum with words of encouragement, saying that if people talk about the problem directly, then the community can start to fix it and then see results. I was really shocked. Um, I mean, I know a lot of drugs and stuff, but I never thought heroin would be a number one for Tioga County. Along with bath salts and prescription drugs, Heroin is rapidly becoming a problem that police are having to deal with. Wellsboro Police Chief Jim Bodine says heroin is being brought in from Williamsport, Elmira, and every other direction. Everywhere. It's coming from, there, there's no one particular spot that you can say that it's coming from. We know it's coming from northeast, south, and west is the best way to put it. Um, and to say it's coming from one geographical state, no. It, there's no way. Officials on stage told story after story about how drugs can ruin lives. And the emergency room nurse manager from Soldiers and Sailors Memorial Hospital in Wellsboro spoke up, saying the hospital is treating more drug and heroin use. The forum wasn't intended to scare the community, but to educate. As um, law enforcement agencies and as school districts, we're trying to educate the public on drug trends that we are seeing within our communities and how to educate our parents as well as our students to stay away from illegal drug use. Now some big tips for parents and grandparents is to lock away your prescription drugs and also talk to your kids. You know, communication can be the best way to stop a child's drug use. Live in studio, Joe Melillo, WNY-TV News.